Hello, ladies and gents. Blah Fubar here, fucked up beyond all recognition. Playing the game Tom Clancy's The Division. And I thought I'd make this little video because I've been busy working and and today I decided to go on it and have a shot of it. And something that's been annoying me a lot about this game and the amount of money I paid for it, and I'd never usually ever moan about a game, is this PC light and flickering carry on that's going on with it. This constant flickering and, you know, I know it gives you a warning beforehand, you know, if you are uh, suffer from epilepsy or anything like that, uh, preferably not to play the game. Uh, but I don't suffer from any of these things. Lucky for me, unfortunate for other people. Uh, but my god, it is damn annoying. And I find myself I can't actually play the game for a good length of time because I feel myself really starting to get quite a pounding headache. So I actually went on the game today, which I've not been on it for a little while, because busy and life and all them things, nice. and was absolutely shocked when I got into the game. Well, hence to say when I eventually got into the game, when I was, what, 2,554 or whatever in the queue, which is dirty wrong, is really awesome that everybody wants to play this game. I will keep it alive for a long, long time. But anyway, getting back to my subject, this flickering on Tom Clancy's The Division. So I went on it and I thought, oh my God, what is going on here? This is so bad it's just unplayable now. And I paid a lot of money for the game, you know. And my world, three days works worth of money for this game. So, yes, I went on and I thought, oh, so I went on to all the different sites and noticed there was a lot of other people complaining about the same thing. That is. So, just to give you a, a little insight, uh, Gaming Rig, or Gaming PC, which has cost me a lot of money to make over the years, or build, is running two Sapphire Radeon R9 280X Vapors, right, and they're on Crossfire. It's on a high-end AMD motherboard. So, I'm not impressed. This is supposed to be a game with the ultimate graphics. It's supposed to be able to do amazing things, but the more you read into it, if you're a, an AMD gamer, it kind of looks like this game's not made for you. This game seems to be more made for NVIDIA. But, that's what I started to think the more I started to read stuff about it. So, I read an article that said that if you've got AMD graphic cards, or Radian graphic cards I should say, um, to take them off Crossfire, and it might resolve your problem. So I thought I'd go ahead and do that. And then I tried a couple of other things, messed about with this and messed about with that, that I did, just basically to try and help out other people that were having problems with this, because it is really annoying. And in your subconscious, when you're playing a game, and you're concentrating on the game, or you're enjoying it, and you're not really paying attention to the slight flickering that's going on in the background, it's not until you actually come out of the game, you think, my God, I've got such a headache. As I do know they recommend that you should only play a game for so long and have a rest for every 15 minutes. But we all know. True gamers, you love a game, you'll sit and play it for hours and hours and hours. Not unless you need to go for a pee, make a cup of coffee, or answer the door, or the phone rings. You know how it goes. So, after nearly an hour and a half of trying this out and the next thing and coming in and out of the game, and it's still being the same, I thought, oh, what the hell? You know, all this money and now I've got a game I can't even play, I don't seem to be able to fix it. What the hell is going on here? And then, believe this or not, but this solved my problem. So yes, it was my Adobe Flash Player. It was out of date. Not by much. 
but it was out of date. And the one I've got in now is Adobe Flash Player NPAPI. I installed that, restarted my computer, and I've got to admit I've also taken my graphic cards off a of Crossfire that I have, and it just looks fantastic now. I have no problems with it. So there you go, between the time I have not played it, Obviously, that had run out. But it is interesting to notice the amount of people that are having this problem. So basically, to be quite honest, spending £2,000 over the course of five years building a high-end gaming PC, it's ironic that I spend all this money on a game and spend an hour and a half pulling my hair out, which I've got to be quite honest, I don't know much of, trying to figure this out for such a simple thing. So I actually thought I'd put this on my YouTube channel just to show all my fellow gamers the problem I was having, and this might actually be quite a simple little fix, is to check that your adobes are up to date. I've got three gaming support Adobe's in, which is Adobe Flash Player ActiveX, Adobe Air, and Adobe Flash Player MPAPI. The latest ones there possibly is. And I resolved my problem. So, ladies and gents, thanks very much for coming and listening to me blabbing on because I was a bit brassed off. I've hardly got to play my game the day at all, or upload any videos about it. But, I'm a happy chap. I resolved my problem. So thank you for coming along to watch my video. Blah, fubar. Fucked up beyond all recognition.